The two-day annual Lakotla of the ANC Parliamentary Caucus came to a decision to pass the Public Administration Management Bill that will prohibit any public representatives or civil servants from doing business with the state. At the Lakotla, it was also decided to relook at political party funding for those that make it into Parliament, saying money needs to be made available so that activities for politicians are properly funded. For Parliament to remain relevant as an agent for qualitative change in the lives of our people, we call upon the institution to change the current parliamentary political party funding model to ensure that parties have the necessary capacity to effectively conduct their constituency business. There is general recognition that appropriate and sufficient funding of political parties is not only critical to the functionality and fulfillment of parties' core responsibilities, but also to our maturing multi-party democracy. The court has deliberated on the code of ethical conduct and disclosure of financial interests for assembly and permanent council members and supported its objectives of promoting ethical conduct among public representatives, thereby ensuring public confidence in Parliament. Mechanisms to discourage unethical conduct must be created at all levels to enhance the integrity of our state institutions. Thereby, we will also prioritize the enhance and enhance the sorry, passing of the public administration and management bill, which will, among others, make it illegal for civil servants to do business with the state. We, we have uh, collectively agreed that we amend that sentence to include the representatives as well. I'm worried that we have not been effective in communicating this need for party funding. You would recall that there is a law in South Africa which requires political parties represented in parliament get state funding. And when it was arranged, the funding comes from IEC, but that funding from the IEC goes to political parties in how they run their own institutions. It it's not the amount of money coming to us as MPs in Parliament. Our, our, our funds given to us in Parliament are through salaries and the tools of trade here. They don't deal with particular functions that we perform. Uh, in, in making Parliament efficient and effective.